Jack Dorsey predicts the Bitcoin price to hit at least $1 million by 2030, hitting that number and going beyond. But far more interesting was his long and detailed interview about the end of social media in which Jack decries his previous strategy of supporting Blue Sky, saying that he essentially wasted $14 million, that he should have given all the money to Noster instead, and even admits that Twitter was wrong the whole time because it used advertising. Recently, he has given $5 million to the OpenSats Noster Fund, as well as $15 million to their general fund, and $1 million to their operations budget. But you're here for the price. Victoria Jones, what do you think about Jack's prediction that the price of Bitcoin will hit $1 million, dollars, 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 dollars? Uh, yeah, I'm sure many Bitcoiners are familiar with uh, similar predictions. You know, generally speaking, it's, uh, you know, a one with how many zeros after it. You know, there's lots of uh, there's lots of debates about that. And, um, you know, I think ultimately when Bitcoin takes over the world and everyone's using it for transactions, that's entirely possible. But, um, you know, until we get to the stage where the uh, existing financial system has broken, I don't think it's going to happen. I mean, really, Bitcoin is designed as an inflation hedge. And at the moment, the things that are going on in the wider economy are actively designed to create deflation. So I think we need a deflationary crisis before Bitcoin's really going to take off. I just like the trend that the bigger the celebrity that you are, the bigger prediction you can make on Bitcoin and the larger number series of articles that they'll make about it. Jack comes out here with a million. Max Kaiser and Mad Bitcoins, of course, famously have said one infinity, you know, just infinity. Uh, but again, the same article, journalist doesn't have to do any work. You rewrite the article, you just plug in the, the names and the prediction amount. It's just like Mad Libs. Josh Shigala, what do you think? Uh, today's Mad Lib is Jack Dorsey and $1 million. Uh, um, uh, I am on unmute. <laughs> um, <laughs> Uh, yeah, well, the, first of all, I couldn't give a crap what that guy says. He screwed up Twitter. 